Alright, what's going on guys? It's Val Rico here, and today we're playing some Call of Duty Black Ops 2 multiplayer gameplay on the PC. And today I want to talk about blocking people. And this is kind of a video response to one of my older videos about a year ago, which was titled, Only Cowards Block People. And that was a response to um, a couple of these corporate slave Xbox fans. Uh, one of them is called The Mooch, and the other one is called uh, Crap Gamer. And for some reason I was blocked, and I never said anything to these people. I don't know if it was because I retweeted something Sony said uh, or, you know, retweeted a trailer of a PlayStation game or something like that. These guys are corporate slaves. They make like 10 videos a day bashing Sony, meanwhile trying to praise Xbox but not play any of their exclusives or any of their games. But that's not the point of the video. They're irrelevant to this video. I still stand by my statement that only cowards block people and I want to modify it a little bit because of I don't know the, the election season and the people that expose themselves as psychopaths really to be honest and maniacs um, I want to modify the only cowards block people to block people you're allowed to block people this is the new rule now you're allowed to block people that just say dumb shit okay and you just want them when I block somebody it's only because I said some dumb shit, and I imagine that me deleting them from existence, from life. Basically, look at this bullshit right here. These cowards, speaking of cowards, sitting adjacent from each other in corners with shotguns. Oh, best believe I wasn't going to tolerate that. I was going to come right back here and fuck these guys up for doing that dumb shit. Look at this bullshit. One with a grenade. Get out of the fucking corner. But I imagine when I block people that I'm like God. And I delete them from existence. They just die. Because some of the shit that you see on social media is so preposterous that you just have to laugh. And I just hit the little, you know, and it's mostly on Twitter because I, I stay on Gap. I only go on Twitter to, um, you know, check the MMA um, articles and things of that nature. See what's happening on MMA because most of my followers are MMA or, you know, a few gaming sites like PC Gamer, uh, Game Informer, shit like that. You know, I go on there and check. That's mostly my, my t I use Twitter as a news feed more than talking to people. I use that as a news feed. And when I see some dumb shit on there, like when I go check some of these trends and I look at the shit that people say, I always click on their profile. I just want to see what their profile says underneath their picture. And if it says some dumb shit, delete, delete, delete. Like Broken Matt Hardy would say, DELETE! I hit them with the block. Not because they said anything to me. I would never block anybody that says anything to me. I'll just go fire back at them. I don't give a fuck. You know, if they said something disrespectful, I'm not gonna delete anything. Delete their name or anything like that. I'm not gonna block them. I'm just gonna fire back. And that'll be that. But when somebody says something dumb in a timeline of a trend, I just start deleting people in the timeline aka block them they never exist and I don't have to see their dumb comments anymore when I go check a future trend because there's some really dumb people in this world I, it's really shocking after this election it really exposes hypocrites frauds and liars and you can say whatever you want about the president I don't care it doesn't matter I voted for him and that is the bottom line because Stone Cold said so and I will vote for him again in 2020 it's just what it is it's my freedom as an American. But since his election, he has mindfucked people so bad, especially in the entertainment industry, so bad that it exposes people for being absolutely nuts. And my favorite thing to do in the world is to block blue checks. Oh, they're the best. They're the best. Because like I said earlier, I imagine, I imagine deleting them from life. And for some reason, Twitter gives blue checks to fucking absolute retards that have never you, you don't even know who these people are they, like, they have like 7,000 followers but they got a blue check and they and, they, and they've never done anything they haven't wrote a book they haven't made a movie they haven't fucking done nothing nothing and they're just they got blue checks it's insane they're not even like popular on social media it's just they I don't know what they do what do they do so Twitter is pretty much fucked that's why I don't ever get on there no more that's why I don't... Oh my god, this was a disgusting way to end this match. This shotgun was pretty biblical. 
But uh, that's pretty much all I have to say. I just wanted to modify my uh, stance on blocking people because it's not that I'm uh, they've said anything to me, but the shit they say is so egregious and retarded that I blocked them to clean up my timeline and clean up the Twitter trends so I can enjoy a good trend without having somebody say some dumb shit, like saying there's more than two genders. That's just absolutely preposterous. Anyways, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Hit the like button, the subscribe button, gab.ai slash Valrico, youtube.com slash Valrico, and I'm out of this bitch. Peace.